The City of Helena Commission has unanimously approved the mural for the Lindale Tunnel. Art creates the quality of life. The design, named Wildfire by Elise Perpinando, commemorates the 75th anniversary of the Man Gulch Fire. A different story on each side and within the tunnel. So on one side we've got Gates of the Mountains, a very historical area. We've got a lot of animals, plant life, and then once you go through the tunnel, on one side we have sort of wildfire life cycle, which is very important in nature. Other side is kind of Missouri River, um, Sleeping Giant, more plants, animals. And then other side is a tribute to the um, smoke jumpers from the Man Gulch Fire. The Man Gulch Fire was first officially reported around noon on August 5, 1949. The Forest Service dispatched smoke jumpers from Missoula to the remote area. The 15 smoke jumpers landed at Man Gulch about a half mile away. Of the 16 men on site, only three would end up surviving. But it's something that I feel like most residents of Helena have sort of a connection or like a, you know, a soft spot for. Purpin Nano is a lifelong Helena resident who also designed and painted the Centennial Trail Tunnel under Last Chance Gulch connecting Memorial Park and Centennial Park. 19 submissions were received for the Lindale mural. Wildfire was not the original recommendation from the Public Arts Committee, but it was important to the commission that a Helen artist was chosen. The uh, Public Arts Committee selected the Queen of the Rockies mural, but the staff and the commission voted on um, the wildfire. It's a local artist. The city will pay per banana $15,000 but the contract stipulates the artist will supply all materials needed for the mural with those funds. The project is expected to start in early April and be completed by the end of July. I'm very thankful to have this opportunity and to continue to grow our local art like scene. Um, and I think it'll be really beautiful once it's all done and tied together. In Helena, Rachel Fortunato, MTN News.